Hello, today I'm going to try to update uh, the remote of the Phantom 3 with the new firmware. Uh, I have the early 300A model. Uh, until now I have uh, did updates only using a SD card and a card reader connected to its USB port. This time the update is only for the remote, there's no aircraft uh, firmware so it uh, must be done using the DJI GO application I have installed it on my phone it's uh, the latest version from the market there are uh, several issues reported that uh, using the latest version uh, will make it uh, impossible to update the firmware I'm going to try to update it and see if it uh, works or not I'm gonna turn on the remote. I'm gonna zoom in a bit on the phone. Okay. I'm gonna start the application. And enter camera view. And there's the message. It was short update required. I'm gonna click on no signal, update required, okay. Download firmware. Let's see if it uh, goes well. I'm gonna adjust this a bit. It's better now. Okay. Please don't disconnect the RC. Okay, at least 50% battery start upgrade. So the update has started. As you can see, we have blue light here and beeping sound. And we also have a progress bar. have an upgrading status okay I'm gonna leave it on and come back later so we are at 97 percent it's uh, been about uh, five minutes let's see if it uh, finishes the update okay the beeping has stopped. Now I we we had an amber light. Now it's blue again. We still have a message that uh, we should not disconnect or turn off the remote control. Ninety nine percent. It's almost done. Okay, upgrade completed. Please reboot your remote controller. Okay, we have an option to delete the firmware package if we want to save on space. I will not going to delete it. So, I'm gonna turn off the remote. Remote is off. And now I'm going to turn it back on. Okay. No signal as the aircraft is disconnected. Firmware version, it's the latest. So the update was successful. Bye bye.